Brisbane researchers have found southeast Queenslanders are at an increasing risk of mosquito-borne diseases. A mozzie lab at the Ecker urging us to be more vigilant when it comes to protecting ourselves. It doesn't come as a surprise, but now we have the proof. There's nothing mozzies like to feast on more than us. Mosquitoes in urban parks take almost all their blood meals from humans. Researchers from QIMR Berghofer's Mosquito Control Group finding people are the preferred target over animals after a study on mozzies caught by traps in Bracken Ridge, Corinda, Indrapilly and Banyo. Alarmingly, further testing found more than 50% of people who use local parks have been exposed to Ross River virus. Ross River was thought to be a disease very much of bushland and swampland. It would now appear that's changing. Infection can lead to Ross River fever, which isn't deadly but debilitating. Sufferers of the disease reporting symptoms that can last months or years. I still find sometimes when I'm trying to open a jar or open a, a bottle of Coke or whatever, I find I can't grip things. Even with El Nino conditions bringing a drier than normal summer, mosquito numbers are still likely to boom, brought on by hot temperatures. Mosquito Control hoping its mozzie lab at the ECA this year will encourage people to be more vigilant, protecting themselves from bites. For a whole number of mosquito-borne viruses in Australia, there are no vaccines and there are no drugs. Claire Todd-Hunter, Nine News.